This week on Motor Scratch Dispatches, we've got two big announcements from Maruti Suzuki. One being the all-new Swift that was unveiled in Geneva. And we got to drive the Beleno RS out on the track at BIC. Renault has launched a quid climber. Tata's sub-brand, Tamo, unveiled their first car in Geneva, the Race Mo. An interesting topic, which we will get to. And last but not least, I got to drive Honda's latest compact crossover, the WRB. Honda is all set to debut with the WRB. It's a compact crossover. It's going to come with a 1.2 liter iVTEC engine as well as the 1.5 liter iDTEC engine. I got to drive both of those variants around in Goa and I was really impressed by the diesel. That's the one to go for if you're looking for a nice, compact, spacious crossover. There's nothing more exciting than being out on a road trip. Not a care in the world, no emails to check. Hey, I've not even bothered shaving for a week. It's about being carefree, out there, and having a great time. If you're interested in road trips, check out www.questadventure.com. Our friend and fellow contributor Sopan Sharma was out at the Buddha International Circuit driving around in the all-new Boleno RS. That's the Boleno that comes with the booster jet engine. It's a one-liter engine with three cylinders, turns out 101 bhp, and it's pretty damn fast. He had a blast out on the track. Suzuki has unveiled the all-new Swift. Now the Swift has been around in India for a while and it's been one of those cars that was an immense hit. Everybody loved it. It was considered one of the earliest hot hatches to hit our market. And now the new one looks edgier, more stylish, and we can't wait for it to come to India. A couple of weeks ago, we told you about Tata's sub-brand, Tamo. Now we know what their first product looks like. It's a sports car. Called Racemo, this little thing that debuted at Geneva is going to come with a souped-up Revotron engine that delivers 190 PS of power. It's stylish. It takes Tata in a bold new direction, something no Indian manufacturer has done till date. And are we excited about it? You can bet on that. Renault India has come out with another variant of the Quid. This one's known as the Quid Climber. It's got the 1 liter SEE engine that we absolutely love when it debuted in the Quid, so we know that performance is right on track. They've gone all out aggressive in terms of the styling, both interior and exterior, giving it a more all-terrain attitude. We love the blue and the orange team that is playing off each other. There's a lot of kit on board and it costs 25,000 rupees more than the regular quid 1 liter SCE. Not a bad deal is what we think. And from us to you this week, that's Motorscribes Dispatches. Oh.